chicken. Whoa, well, say it's my own. All done. I think this is stupid. Besides, no one knows how to this ghost. Well, look at the ghost. <laughs> <laughs> my final experiments in my telepod that I've invented. It's a way to travel anywhere in the world, just like a phone booth. You can dial it up, go through the computer, through the cable, and come to Disney World, bring your luggage, you'll be there in 10 seconds. We're gonna demonstrate right now. We're gonna send this little guy through. Ready, Igor? Yes. Stop the generator. Yes, Generator on? Start the pod sequence. Charge pod. Ten seconds. Being broken down now into molecules, being sent through the computer. And it will be sent through the cable. right in here. But Orissus has been very specific, and that's why his tomb remains untouched. 
should not touch any of his treasure. Even while he was living, he hated when I touched his things. We must not touch anything. Could someone, could someone have? Oh no, where is the genie's lamp? You don't know what you've done. Whoever did it, you don't know what you've done. Here he, oh my goodness, it's Orissus. Oh, you must leave, you must leave this place. Oh, Orissus, isn't he handsome? Oh, you must leave, you must leave for your own safety. I see you ladies looking at him, he's mine. He's very handsome, he's mine. You must leave. You kill him, we kill him.
अच्छा है Fisherman, <laughs> but the shark he found out about the affair and he went to kill the fisherman. And they had a big fight, and the shark bit him. And the fisherman fought back, he hit him with his buoy. But the shark got his buoy away from him and smacked him upside the head several times and <laughs> threw him on the deck and started to Hold kick him. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. Okay, first of all, I'm a one shark kind of gal, and there's no way that I would cheat on my sharky. <laughs> wait, you really a Dating a real shark? You're not dating a lawyer? What's the difference? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I have a new theory of what's going on here. If that's not it, here's the new theory. You see, the professor is desperately in love with the fisherman. Yes, that's it! And the fisherman has already professed his love to the mermaid. So, in an act of desperation, the professor concocts a terrible poison liquid that also 